Today, President Biden plans to address the rise in crimes all across the country. Specifically, he's going to focus on ghost guns, which have been at the center of some really high profile crimes here in Metro Atlanta. Right now, people can put ghost guns together right at home from kits they get online. The White House believes classifying some of the parts as firearms would change that. President Biden says ghost guns are particularly dangerous because they don't have serial numbers, meaning they can be traced. The feds report they seized about 1,700 ghost guns back in 2016, but by 2020, that number jumped to nearly 9,000. So this is a huge problem. Ghost guns have been in the headlines here in the metro Atlanta many times. One high profile case being 14 year old Kyra Scott, who was shot and killed just two days after Thanksgiving last year. Police say Scott's brother shot her by accident during a dispute over a ghost gun he was trying to sell to another teenager. President Biden says he wants Congress to mandate background checks for all gun sales, ban assault weapons and high capacity magazines. Also, gun makers to be found liable if their products are used in a crime and fund crime prevention and policing.